Hey guys, it's Matt here, and I'm going to be showing you today how to use a text field uh, using Swift for your iOS application. So let's get started. So first off, I'm going to go ahead and just move this button down a little bit for now, um, just so we can have room for the text field. And we're going to go ahead and come over and drag a text field on. And now I'm just going to make it wider. And then I'm going to bring the button up. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to click on that, and then we're going to control, click, and drag over here to our code. And I'm just going to name it text field. And there. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to delete our button code because we want to call that later. So now we're going to do the same thing. We're going to control, drag, but this time we're going to put our button code down here. Then we're going to go connection, change that to action, and then I'm just going to name that button. Now, what we're able to do is we're able to say text field dot um, resign first responder. That means that the keyboard will drop down. Uh, without that, your app will crash. Um, okay, so then we're able to print or do whatever we want, and then we will do text field dot text, and then we'll do an exclamation point, which just wraps it up. So then we're able to click run. And give it a second to compile. Okay. And now it's running. So we're able to go up here. We're able to open up the keyboard. We can say hello or whatever. And then click me. And then the keyboard resigns and it prints hello. Or we can say hello with an exclamation point. And then it'll print hello with an exclamation point. But anyways, that's it guys. Thank you for watching, and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe, but for now, peace.